The UConn ice hockey team has survived and advanced. After a 4-1 victory over Robert Morris Friday night, UConn followed up with a 4-3 win on Saturday, giving them the sweep and a trip to Rochester for championship weekend. We have high spirits in the room. Uh, we worked hard over the past few weeks to gear up for this game. And uh, we just knew coming out we have efforts from all four lines and uh, it feels great to get it done. There's just more at stake, each, each play, each, each possession, and uh, we just had to value the puck. Oh, I'm so proud of them with, with everything that we've been through this year to, um, you know, get a home ice top four and then get a first round by. Everyone thought we weren't going to win this series, that Robin Morris was going to come in and beat us. So to do it the way we did, uh, it's a credit to the kids and, and the commitment that they've made to be a good hockey team. After falling one nothing in the first period, UConn responded in the second with three goals of their own. Whether we're up a goal, down a goal, uh, we have the same system, same game plan. So we just went out there executing, got a few bounces and uh, came out on top. In the last four weeks, we've come out in second periods and really gone after teams. The guys rose up and they had a great period. We scored that goal right at the beginning. First one was just a good effort by the line mates, sticking with it at the net. Uh, puck game, chip weak side, and I just happened to be in the right spot at the right time. So that was a gift right there from Cody. And then we scored those two goals in about 30 seconds, and it really gave us an emotional lift. Paul has been playing great lately. His freshman stepped up, um, fit in real nice with Cody and I. Uh, he's been moving his feet and using his hands to buy him space and time, and obviously that good release uh, helped us get the lead there. Just 16 seconds after Paulie's goal to take the lead, Ferris netted his fourth of the season, putting the Huskies up 3-1. Ferris, obviously another player that stepped up huge, um, playing with Sean Ambrosi. Uh, guy dropped down, he just had a lot of patience in the slot and let a, a great shot go high glove. Robert Morris responded with a goal late in the second, but Gerling countered with the game winner and his second on the night. Whenever I get scored on, I feel, I feel like all the boys come back right away with a goal, if not two, if not that, then three. On the last one, the guy just kind of taken away the top, uh, saw it land in the net and just let one go on another great screen by Cody. So. A lot of thanks to him. He's had an unbelievable year. Last year he had uh, one point. He had one goal during the entire year, and he was in and out of the lineup. And now he's become a fixture in the lineup, and I believe he has 11 or 12 goals now, and he's got 25 points. The goal he scored was just uh, it was a beautiful goal, and that, that was obviously the game winner. And, and uh, at the time, it gave us a little bit of cushion, which was important. Beginning of the year when we all met the first time in August, uh, heading to Rochester was something we've been looking forward to. So um, we're ready for the moment. Um, we'll live in our glories tonight, but it's coming tomorrow. We'll be gearing up for Rochester. I don't really care who we who we have to play. It's just any team there will be great to play. And then uh, we went there I think two years ago, and it was fun. We had a close game with RIT, and uh, just excited to get back there. We're not the most talented team in the country. We're probably not the most talented team in our league, but what these kids have is they have a belief that I don't think any other team that we compete against has. And they've totally bought into doing what we need to do to be successful. And they believe in each other and they believe in what we're doing. And that's a really powerful thing. And I know that we can beat anyone that we play. And I'm really looking forward to next weekend and see if we can do some uh, miraculous things.